Hey guys. All right, so I figured it is time for me to drop another what is for dinner video because I like these types of videos. Gives me a lot of ideas. So I'm hoping that these videos are also videos that you guys like to watch to give you ideas. So without further ado, let's get into it. So to start off, I'm starting off with some ravioli. I get the big frozen bag from Costco because it's super quick, it's really convenient, and it's also pretty tasty. You put some sauce over that, serve it with some side salad and some garlic breadsticks, and dinner is served in under 30 minutes. My kids love this, my husband loves this, and I like this too. So that was what was for dinner. So dinner tonight, I made enchiladas. So I made a vegetarian one for my husband and my daughter made with falafel filling and then I made chicken enchiladas for my boys. So this is what it looks like, side of corn, some yellow Spanish rice and some barbecue beans. And that is dinner tonight. Dinner tonight was salmon that was marinated in Italian dressing. It doesn't look pretty, but it was so bomb. And the salmon kind of broke apart a little bit, but I mean, it was still good. And then we had some collard greens, some Asian style collard greens that I sauteed down with some soy sauce. And then I made some pureed squash or like mashed squash, kind of like mashed potatoes, but instead of potatoes, I used squash. And that was dinner for that night. It's hash brown casserole for dinner, y'all. It does not look pretty. This is how it got plated. Salad kit that I got from Auto Mercado. It looks like the salad from Olive Garden. And then my middle son does not eat beef, so I made him mac and cheese. This is what it looked like in the dish. I'm making the same thing for my husband and my daughter, but with falafel instead of ground beef. I decided to make a veggie tikka masala just for the non-meat eaters. All right, here is the chicken tikka masala with potatoes. And then the non bread. <laughs> All right, dinner, chicken tikka masala. Chicken tikka masala with potatoes and some corn, broccoli, and non bread and all of that over some white rice you guys i made the beef cubes that i brought that i bought from price mart over rice these are the ones it's a two pack i have to do a taste test this one was real good I had it over mashed potatoes like you see it on the box. It was real good. You just warm it up on the stove. I defrosted it first in the fridge. And then you just warm it up on the stove. Super quick. Real easy. Let's see if it's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, y'all. It's good. I added some of the Shakira sauce to it because it's spicy. Real good. All right, so I made beans over rice. These are like canned beans, but I did cook them, season them up, and I also made dumplings. But my husband's not a huge fan, so I don't. I didn't put any on his. So it's basically coconut beans over rice, and then some tomatoes and some avocado but it's a really simple dinner tonight but it's really really good stuffed shells for dinner and they're vegetarian everybody already ate and there's a lot left over y'all real quick dinner tonight i'm excited about this meal plan so i made sloppy joe's it's been a minute i didn't have the sloppy joe mix so i just made it do what it had to do coleslaw on top on a burger bun that's toasted 
cheddar cheese and sour cream, great value, chips. And then for the non-meat eaters, because that's ground beef, I have falafel. So they're gonna be getting falafel sloppy joes. And then I'm making some of this pesto pasta, mainly for my two younger boys because my middle son does not eat beef and he doesn't like falafel. I'll see about my 10 year old, but if not, they can have this with the coleslaw. So that's dinner for tonight. We got curry chicken for dinner, y'all. I did not put carrots in it. Looks good. Let's see. Oh, I made my husband salmon. And I'm making potatoes on the side. So the kids will have potatoes. I did make some rice. My husband will have salmon with that. And these are the potatoes that I'm making on the side. That's dinner, Saturday. So I'm making sandwiches tonight. I made a fish sandwich on a ciabatta roll. Ours took a bite. It's pretty good. And some chips. I got some salad on there and a couple of different spreads. It's really good. All right, dinner tonight. Mashed potatoes, bean, coleslaw and salmon for my husband and my oldest. And then my meal, I made the beef cubes. Mm. All right, y'all, mama made lasagna and it's vegetarian lasagna. I used the Beyond Beef. You guys saw that in my grocery haul and the different cheeses. I had some herb and garlic goat cheese. I had some ricotta, mozzarella, parmesan, all the cheeses. So lasagna and then salad, croutons, and breadsticks. That's dinner tonight. If I remember, I'll show you guys my plate when I plate it all up. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to fill my plate, but here it is, plated up. The lasagna, the veggie lasagna, garlic bread, and salad. Tonight for dinner, it's Caesar salad, or just salad with croutons and ranch dressing. This olive oil and garlic pasta, my husband's suggestion, has like parsley and red pepper flakes and then some garlic breadsticks. All right guys, so for dinner tonight, I made this Cajun pasta, Cajun chicken pasta, but like for the non-meat eaters, you know, Cajun pasta. I saw this recipe on a YouTube shorts and it was simple and easy. I picked up a couple of the ingredients today and just went to work and it is really, really good. Some salad on the side and the breadsticks. And that is what is for dinner. <laughs> 